food safety is important because food is life. It is something which allows us to enjoy something which is a definition of life, which is how we eat together. And it's very important because it binds together our families, those who are most vulnerable, and it's vital for our economy. The intelligent thing, of course, is to put in efficient systems and to use research and innovation and to enable behaviours that will allow us to manage the risks in the most efficient way and the least intrusive way whilst making sure that the underpinning systems are delivering continuous safety and control and reassurance for our citizens and businesses and communities alike. And one of course is the responsibility that we have which is written into Horizon 2020 in the framework programmes to deliver what is a public good. Food safety and public health is a public good and we need to use the brightest and the best ideas to make that happen. The European Union uh, remains convinced, it's in our DNA, that we have to be open to the world and that's why this program is the most open of its kind in the world and so Club for Safety again shows this, the global cooperation, the bringing together of different views on the problem of food safety and the opportunities bring it together and then there's an emphasis on the translation into innovation in the future. So in a way it's, a, it's an encapsulation of what we're trying to achieve in many of the larger programme theme. Collab for Safety is a network of food safety research institutes that goes beyond the European Union. It not only has partners from Europe, but it also has partners from Russia, from China and from Brazil and also from other countries. So these people meet uh, now and then, uh, they exchange information and they discuss uh, topics that are of common interest. Well, all over the world we have the same problems and by working together we share each other's experience and in that way we get the most out of it. The EU has put in place a whole system of laws and controls and of inspections and of incentives to make sure that from, from farm to fork the food that arrives on your plate in your home meets the standards that are required. Industry really has a leading role in understanding and explaining where the critical control points are. The government has a role to monitor whether these companies do their work in a good way and if necessary to enforce this. And then at the European Union level on the one hand you have for the independent science, you have the European Food Safety Authority to provide independent scientific advice on risks and the assessment of risks. You have the European Commission whose job is actually to initiate legislation and protection with all the commissioners meeting and making decisions and those decisions then are passed on to the legislators which is the member states, the 28 countries who will then uh, decide on adopting the laws in agreement with the European Parliament, the directly elected representatives of the people. So food safety at all levels is derived from, controlled by, in the service of all of the people of the European Union and is, is accountable to the institutions that are put in place to protect their interests. And lastly, whoever you're working with in terms of as a society and economy, as a trading partner, you have to keep connected with them. So you need to work with your partners across Europe and outside Europe in, in different parts of the world where we work together. It's a partnership. It's a collaboration between the individual and the society. Mm -hmm.